What is up guys? It's uh it's really early in the morning right now here in Wisconsin. It's 3.42 a.m. and uh, I just found these on my shelf. I guess my parents bought them. It's new. This is going to be a food review. It's new Pop-Tarts Go Nutty Peanut Butter and Jelly Strawberry. Um, here's what it looks like. This doesn't look too amazing because uh, it's not full of the frosting. But this is a regular one from the packaging. And this one is toasted. Now, um, right off the bat, you notice that this box, it's orange. <clears throat> Usually the, uh, the Pop-Tarts boxes are like a dark blue like this. Um, but I remember with the chocolate and strawberry, uh, Pop-Tart last year that it was an orange box. And usually the Pop-Tarts come in a silver wrapper. Uh, I don't know if you can tell... Oops. <clears throat> but these do come in a gold wrapper, which is just something different. Um, <clears throat> the peanut butter and chocolate ones also did come in a gold wrapper last year, but I never had them. Um, <clears throat> but the first thing I'm going to make, because this is going to be like my first ever review. Um, for I'm going to plan to do, in, if I eventually do more food reviews or something... Out of, uh, for food reviews, my rating scale is going to be 1 to 5. 1 being bad, 5 being amazing. So, food reviews is going to be 1 to 5. And if I ever do video game reviews, it's going to be 1 to 10. Once again, 1 being worse, 10 being the amazing. And then movie reviews is also going to be 1 out of 10. Um, 1 obviously being worse, and 10 being amazing. So... If I ever do food reviews, like I said, it's going to be 1 through 5. Game and movie reviews is 1 through 10. I was actually going to review, um, I seen Pixels in 3D last this past Saturday. Um, I thought it was a pretty good movie. I was going to do a movie review for it after I seen it, but I just didn't feel like it after that. <clears throat> uh, I still kind of want to do one, but I don't know how many people would watch it because I'm there's tons of reviews up. But anyways, here's the box again. Here's the nutritional facts, 190 calories, I think that's only one pastry though, I don't know. But anyways, let's give this bad boy a try. We're gonna, this is how it looks. Okay, it's got some red sprinkles. Alright, we're gonna take a bite of the untoasted one first. That's the inside, and there's actually peanut butter and jelly in, and I love peanut butter and jelly. Um, I've eaten peanut butter and jelly sandwiches ever since I was a kid. It's not bad. Um, it's really, when you first have your first bite, <clears throat> there's flavor, but it's not like the peanut butter and jelly right away. The peanut butter and jelly that you see inside it comes in at the end, so... All right, <clears throat> here's the toasted one. Cut the little corner. Let's give this one a try. Hmm. I have to say the toasted one. <clears throat> um, I do prefer toasted pop tarts or the regular pop tarts but say if i'm late to my to get to school i'll just um grab a pop tart eat it on the way there but i do like toasted pop tarts and i have to say i really did like the toasted one the peanut butter and jelly flavor came in right away with the toasted one um <clears throat> yeah it was it was okay it's not bad pretty good uh, I definitely recommend giving this a try if you have peanut butter and jelly like I do. Here in Wisconsin, here in <coughs> here in Wisconsin, we have the Wisconsin State Fair, and uh, we have all these pretty delicious, fattening foods. Like we have a Krispy Kreme cheeseburger that's really good. We have a uh, we have deep fried peanut butter and jelly on a stick, which I actually get every year. I think it's really good, but usually I have to work out a lot before I go to the fair and before 
and after because you just eat so many calories and uh, I don't want to get just let that fat sit in me and you know gain fat um we also have chocolate covered bacon but I'm gonna give this one more bite and I'm gonna give you the score Like I said, it's not bad. It's actually kind of tasty. Um, it's a pack of six. We get two in each pack, so three packs. Um, I don't know how much this was. It could be a limited time. I don't know, but I definitely recommend trying them if they're uh, a cheap sale. Like two bucks would be good. Um, we love peanut butter and jelly. I highly recommend these. But if you don't, you're you probably wouldn't like these. Um, so out of a five, I'm gonna give this a three flat. I'm gonna give these the Pop Tarts peanut butter and jelly strawberry. I'm gonna give them a three out of five. I recommend it, and uh, you should try them. So, all right, guys, it's about four and it's three forty-eight now, and um, I'm uh, gonna go watch some George Lopez and uh, try to head to bed. So, alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, if you tried these a lot, let me know what you think about them, and if you enjoyed them or you hated them. So, alright guys, see you next time.